morning. It's Sunday morning, November 3rd. I don't know what time it is. I got no clue. 10 o'clock maybe? I don't know. Anyway, I got two Etsy orders that need to go out in tomorrow's mail, so we're gonna head over to the box and drop them in the slot. It's really bright out here and I forgot my sunglasses. But yeah, trying to get our Sunday morning started slowly after yesterday's helping our niece out. And uh, I think we're gonna take it easy today. We're gonna go um, look at a couple of open houses uh, that are in the area, do a little grocery shopping. The kids are coming back for dinner and my sister and her husband. So we're gonna go take care of that. I've got some daily drawing to do. And we need to drop off our ballots, our voting ballots. It's too late to mail them, so we need to drop them off. So we're gonna go do that. Even though it's Sunday, we should be able to do that. And there was something else I was gonna tell y'all, but I don't remember what it is. So yeah, when I remember, I'll let you know. I'll be back. Hey guys, I was gonna say good morning, but it's 12:11, so good afternoon. It is Monday, November 4th. My sister and her husband, Philip, uh, Elizabeth and Philip, they just um, left a little while ago for the airport. They're flying home to Utah today. It was great to have them here. And um, they helped get a lot of stuff done in our niece's house, which is wonderful. Um, our niece and, and her husband are the ones who had a new baby and since then life has just gotten overwhelming let's say for them so we got them some a bunch of stuff done at their house on Saturday when we were there and then Elizabeth and Philip stayed overnight and helped them get a whole bunch more done um, so that was great it was great to visit with them I did need to do something in my house about my wealth jar um, if you're into feng shui then you know 
um, about um, fixing the chi and energy in your house and um, that was my picker sorry um, and um, uh, my picker see um, and having a wealth jar um, where the chi can see it when um, you walk in and the energy flows in and I hadn't quite figured that out she did help me figure out figure out a solution that may be permanent um, it, unless I put a shelf somewhere down lower but hang on and as, as I was saying hold hold on she says don't let it get dusty but that's a good spot so I may not have to move it. Hang on, I have these display ledges up here in a couple spots in the house. This one faces the front door. And right there at the edge, you see that little blue jar? That's our wealth jar. So she just says, just don't get it let dusty, which I won't. And um, yeah, so that's a good spot, evidently. So we're all... Fred is home. I didn't vlog about this because, honestly, I was trying to hurry up and get the vlog posted, uh, edited for this week and get it saving and get all that done before he got home and we went out to go do this, which I'll tell you about in a minute. And that didn't happen because Facebook put me in Facebook jail again. Jail! So, I'm in jail again. Did I click go? Did I click? Did I pass go? Did I click 200 bucks? <laughs> right? So the only thing we can figure is that I post a creative wanderings type, uh, creative thoughts kind of thing in my personal Facebook group in a, uh, and in three other Facebook groups I'm either admin in or have permission uh, from the person who owns the group to do and I just copy and paste That may be a problem for the new Facebook algorithms and evidently it doesn't like it I did get an um, email notification late this afternoon that they had done this um, Which I didn't get last time and it had to do with this particular post so I'm guessing that's what's setting it off but I post daily art pictures and a whole bunch of stuff across in a bunch of groups. So I don't know, I may not be able to do that anymore. So fun fact, if you guys have any ideas, let me know. All right, we're gonna go now and go get some canned goods for a charity food drive that they're having at his work. Um, so we're gonna head down to the grocery outlet and um, we have a budget and we're gonna just blow it all on canned goods for the needy. Yeah. And um, so we're gonna go take care of that. And yeah, I guess if you wanna see my daily thoughts creatively speaking and you want to see my daily art you want you need to either be on my personal page or in my personal Facebook group hopefully I can post to just those two and it doesn't get flagged but I don't know we'll find out I'll be back good morning guys it is Tuesday morning November 5th 7 29 a.m. can you tell by the bags under my eyes it's early <laughs> um so as I posted yesterday uh, to social media and here on the vlog, I'm in Facebook jail again. Uh, I do think, I, I think I know why this time. It seems like once a year for the past few years, something happens in my art and social media life that makes me rethink things and um, change things up. And this is no exception. I'm taking it as the universe's way of... Uh, a kick to the head, if you will, um, uh, to change things. And I did it when it happened this time last year uh, and the year before that it happened. And so I'm just taking it as a message. It were it was different. It were. That's good English. Holy cow. Need more coffee. Um, it was different, different things then. It wasn't a, a Facebook jail thing. Um, every year it's a different thing. Um, sometimes it's a art friend, uh, falling out with an art friend uh, or an art person. Sometimes it's uh, a YouTube thing. Who knows? Every year it seems to be something different. But this year it's Facebook jail. So I think I'm going to just take it as a message to do things up a little differently. Um, I do post in a number of groups every day. I usually just copy and paste the same thing in a bunch of, in a few groups, not a bunch of groups, in four groups. Um, I'm going to stop doing that, and I'm going to um, do thoughts in my personal group, A Life of Art and Self-Expression, which I've been doing thoughts there for a long time. Um, I'm going to add a fifth group. I'm going to do um, regular posts in a chronic pain group, maybe daily posts over in the chronic pain group. Uh, artsy Endeavors, I'll probably do a color post. Um, Leslie's creative uh, studio I'll probably do a muse post 
and over in uh, Art Joy of Sharing, I'll probably do a sort of a where, what are you making today kind of post. That's my thoughts for the moment anyway. So I'm going to use it as a message of what I should change and how I should change things up. I'm also going to be looking into new forms of social media, someplace else where it's more safe to post things. Um, not that there is any. Um, I know Facebook, and they own Instagram now, Facebook, if you didn't know that. Uh, so Facebook, Instagram, even Twitter, YouTube, they're all undergoing changes for the new year. Algorithm changes, YouTube's undergoing um, monetization changes. Um, some of them are very needed, but in the meantime, some of us who have innocent posts get caught in the crossfire. So we're just going to have to work with it, right? So I'm going to have some more coffee. Take a shower. I did get the vlog edited last night, so I've got to get that loaded and get that set and ready to go. And then I may go run a couple of errands and try to get some art done today. So we'll see where we get with that. I'll be back. If you're watching this, you watched the uh, video clip of me at the sewing machine. I have a new uh, bag pattern I'm working on of my own design. Um, pencil bag, daily drawing bag, a small one. And so uh, anyway, I'm going to make a few of them as Christmas gifts. I've got two made. I need to make eight. Um, I've got two more cut out. I'm using fabric with my own artwork on it. Um, if it's something you'd like to see a video on, leave me a comment down below and we'll see what we can do. Um, I'm hoping I can get all eight made by like Sunday, but we'll see. Mm, not sure if that's going to happen or not, but we'll find out. Um, I need at least four made before the weekend. So we'll see what we can do, how far I can get. All right, that's it for the moment. I'm going to go take down the skeletons and things that my husband was going to do like four days ago and forgot or ran out of time or was working late and it was too dark or yeah. So I'm going to go do it for him and leave him on his workbench and he'll, he can put them where he wants when he gets home. And yeah, I'm going to go do that and I'll be back.
Okay, so I don't know what time it is. It's late. It's almost quarter after six. Oh. No, it's about. It looks later than it really is. It's, it's black it's, outside. It's 25. We don't care. We're going walking anyway. Uh, we got flashlights. I got a hand warmer stuffed in my glove. So does Bob. It's 46 degrees outside. Sorry about the weird lighting, but you know, it's dark. Anyway, we're gonna go get a few steps in before we go home and have a nice big bowl of chili. All right, I'll Guys, be back. It's Wednesday morning. It's 11.38 ish on the 6th of November. So I got out of Facebook jail last night. I'm back in Facebook jail again. So I'm gonna just take a 30 day hiatus from Facebook. I have to rethink how many posts I do in the morning and how quickly I do them because it obviously doesn't like that I post a bunch of things in a row within the space of like 20 or 30 minutes. It doesn't like it. I support a lot of different art Facebook groups, including two of my own, and I do put some kind of creative support thing in all the groups and evidently Facebook doesn't like that. And there's nobody to manually review anything, nobody to talk to. I've tried emailing a few people. Um, I don't think it's gonna help. I'm just gonna take a 30 day break. So if you wanna follow what I'm doing every day creatively, you're gonna have to follow me over on Instagram or Twitter. Um, keep in mind, Instagram is owned by Facebook. So maybe Twitter and YouTube. Anyway, I'm chatting with some friends and trying to get my sewing done I had planned for today, and we'll see how the day plans out. I'll be back. Hey guys, it is Thursday morning, November 7th, and I am just now leaving. It is, what time is it? 8.56 a.m. I am leaving to go make a run to the post office really quick. I've got Etsy orders and Christmas presents that need to be shipped out. And yeah, Christmas presents. Um, I have a few things I want to get out kind of early, so I'm going to do that today, and then um, I need to go to the grocery store. So we're going to do those two things. I, I said yesterday I might go to Costco uh, on my Instagram Live. I don't know if I'm going to actually do it today. I just kind of, I'm not feeling up to it. <sighs> Dealing with more people than absolutely necessary is just, I don't think, my bag today. And the sun is like right there and really bright. Welcome to Oregon. All right, let's go get to it and get it done. Um, I am including some footage. If, you, if you're if you watching this, you've seen it already. Bambi has been by a lot in the last 24 hours. I was gonna try to do an Instagram Live um, from my game room, which Bambi was right outside of eating my bushes. Um, but as soon as I sat down and got everything set up, um, something scared um, her off. Um, it doesn't take much, they're pretty skittish, so. Anyway, that didn't happen. Maybe someday. I'll keep trying. Uh, I am enjoying doing um, more Instagram situations and um, really exploring Twitter more than I've been and that sort of thing since I'm on a Facebook vacation. 
So I'm, I'm really enjoying that. So I'm going to keep up with that for the next month and we'll see where we go from there. It's Friday, 2.55 p.m. It just dawned on me I have a vlog today. <laughs> Oops. So I spent the day um, making some more paper clips, working on chores. You can, you might be able to hear the washing machine and the dishwasher running in the background. Um, figuring out how to do a little bit of social media uh, on Instagram rather than um, Facebook since I'm on a Facebook vacation until the 6th of December. Um, according to Facebook, I can post again as of like 4.57 last night or yesterday afternoon. But I know that's my fourth time I've been in Facebook jail. And I know from the past times that if I go ahead and do some posting, it won't take long for them to put me in jail again. So I'm just going to go on a Facebook vacation for until the 6th. I can still go look at things. I can use Instant Messenger on Facebook, but I, I'm not posting or liking or commenting or anything. So if you need to get a hold of me, then you need to Instant Message me or comment on the video here. Um, go over to Instagram or Twitter. I have both. Um, it is giving me an excuse to go look at Instagram and Twitter. Um, and pay more attention to them, which I don't think that's a bad thing, so. Anyway, got some interesting work done today, and I've been catching up on my reading, and, uh, um, you know, art education things, and I've got my drawings done already for the day because the kids are coming over for dinner, and we'll be walking and doing family stuff, so I got all that done early and some posts shared early. Now I'm just going to watch some YouTube and have some water and take a little break, and I'll be back. Hey guys, it is Saturday, November, oh crud, it's 1.47 November p.m. 9th. Yes, I had to stop the camera and go look. <laughs> um, it's been kind of a quiet morning. Uh, I'm getting ready for some business stuff that's going to happen next week, so I had a Zoom conference call this morning, and then the kids dropped off Lily. They're out doing wedding planning stuff, so we said we'd watch the dog while they're doing that. And I think we're going to go help them in a couple of hours go do some house hunting because they're looking for a house. They're tired of renting. I can't say to blame them. And uh, we might 
get together afterwards and like do dinner or something. Kind of discuss, I think, our findings. Hey guys, it is Saturday night. It's, I think it's just before nine o'clock. It's pretty late. <sighs> Later than I planned on filming the ending of the vlog this week. But um, I did get a shipment of little bubble wrap mailer bags in a couple different sizes. Okay. It's there, so start selling some uh, small things, maybe some of the art clips. So if you're interested in one you've seen me share on social media, let me know, DM me on Instagram or whatever. Picked up some more Tyvek envelopes. Gonna shut things down for the evening. Oh, and start fresh tomorrow. Uh, so anyway, it's been a fun week. I've got some stuff coming up that I can't share right now, but it ought to be really fun. So stay tuned to next week's vlog. Um, because, yeah, some really fun stuff, I think. Stuff that makes me nervous. Stuff that scares me a little bit, to be honest with you. But it's going to be fun nonetheless. Anyway, um, we had fun helping the kids uh, look for a house. I think there's one they might try to put an offer on. I'll keep you all posted. It's been a trial and a tribulation. They really are tired of renting. They really don't want to move again. They want to just buy something and stay for a while. I can't say as a blame them. We were in their position, you know, it seems like just yesterday. And uh, it's tough buying the first plate house and trying to get money together and finances straightened out. And, you know, we're helping where we can. So, uh, and if all we can help, um, if uh, all, if one of the ways we can help is help them look at a house and give them our opinion, then we're happy to do that. Um, so we saw some interesting properties today. One I think was really cute, so, and might work for them. So anyway, it's interesting doing that again, but not having the pressure of it be our house. Does that make sense to y'all? <laughs> it's more fun when you're doing it for somebody else. <laughs> um, anyway, then we went out for a big, huge Mexican dinner uh, at a local place that we really like. I had a salad, I had a shrimp fajita salad, which I really like, they, they make. Um, everybody else had big giant burritos and stuff, so Bob's on the couch and he's just in agony. He ate too much. <laughs> anyway, it's been a fun week and a fun day, and uh, hopefully next week's a repeat of that. Uh, I'll bring you with me either way. <laughs> uh, anyway, I hope you've all had a great one. If there's any uh, links I need to leave you, of course, they'll be in the video description. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave them down below here on the video. Uh, all the different ways you can contact me are on my link tree list of links, among other things that are also in the video description. So be sure to check that out. My happy mail address is down there and all that stuff. If there's content y'all would like to see here on YouTube on my channel, please put something in the comments. Let me know. And uh, yeah, and by the way, uh, in case you haven't heard and I don't remember what I've filmed yet this week, 30 day Facebook vacation. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going up with Facebook. I'm not sure why I've been targeted and why I've been put uh, on as a spam. I don't know, uh, as a spammer, evidently. Um, I don't post political things. I don't post um, anything violent, anything mean. I post art things. So I, I don't know. We're trying to figure it out. My daughter does know somebody from Facebook through her work, so she's you know, giving me some tips. She's in marketing, my daughter, by the way. So she's giving me some tips and hints and we're gonna see what we can do. But uh, 30 day vacation, everybody agrees it's a good idea. So I don't know. Anyway, I'm on Instagram and Twitter in the meantime, so look me up. All right, and of course here on YouTube. And pay I will be on Patreon. I may be on Patreon on a little more, um, not right away. Um, give me uh, until after the 17th, but going live on Patreon might be a thing, just FYI. I'll of course let you know if that is. All right, that's it for now. I hope you've all had a good week. I hope you've all had a good day. Go out and do something fun for yourself and don't forget to do something nice for yourself because you deserve it and I'll see you later. Oh, and like, share, and subscribe if you would. Bye guys.